Okay, well the carby's been taken outside and cleaned down with uh, throttle body cleaner. That's been hosed off and then blown off with compressed air. My trusty compressed air tool. Very useful little things they are. It's also been lit by a um, LED light which cost me about ten dollars which I'll just show you here briefly. That's it, they're capable of being put into any place hung from areas and they've got a magnet on the back so they can be stuck against a, a, uh, anything with metal and they're extremely useful especially if you have two or three of them pointing down at a, a job. In this particular instance it's just to give us a little bit of extra light while we're doing stuff. And the most important thing here of course is to make sure that we've got all the water out of the uh, jets and the uh, orifices in there to make sure that all the little passages are clear. Uh, the, the jets are clean. The jets will be replaced if there's necessary but I'm not going to do anything to this carburetor that doesn't need to be done because it looks as if it's had a fair bit of money spent on it anyway. So I'm going to uh, start off by just dismantling a couple of the odd spots in the carburetor here just to have a look at them. I'll start off by taking the squirter out of the top here. And that's the squirter there, that one. Okay, so then take that out and have a look at that. And I'll stop the, um, the, the machine while I'm doing it. <laughs> 